You're watching America This Morning, America's number one early morning news. And this morning, there are questions about what may have led to the tragic death of a beloved athlete. Junior Seau was found dead in his Southern California home of an apparent suicide. ABC's Taman Bradley has details. This morning, a search for answers into why NFL great Junior Seau may have taken his own life. The medical examiner hopes to provide more information about the 43-year-old's death, perhaps as soon as today. Police say Seau died of an apparent self-inflicted gunshot wound. His family and former teammates are in shock. <laughs> take me, take me, leave my son alone. My brother was a loving brother, a caring citizen. It doesn't make sense, man. I just know how great a heart this guy had. After retiring from the NFL in 2010, Seau survived a 100-foot fall in his SUV down a seaside cliff, hours after his arrest for investigation of domestic violence. Seau apparently joins an alarming number of former football players who've committed suicide, four in little more than a year. All of them showed signs of head trauma. We think in some instances that head trauma uh, could be related to depression, and depression at times uh, can be a cause of suicide. It's not just NFL greats like Seau who are at risk. According to the Centers for Disease Control, high school football players suffer two million brain injuries a year. Seau often advised young players about facing adversity. I want to say to you guys to stick it out and to know that there's going to be a time when football's going to end. Seau's death follows the suicide of former Chicago Bears player Dave Duerson, who shot himself in the chest and in a suicide note, asked that his brain be studied. Rob? Mm, and certainly, Taman, these days, the NFL is so concerned about player safety, particularly head injuries, but what is the league doing to actually better protect its players? Well, that's right, Rob. The NFL says that it takes head injuries very seriously, and the NFL has changed its guidelines in dealing with concussions. They're also, Rob, trying to attack the culture of concussions so players understand it's not okay to simply walk away from them. But the Associated Press polled 44 NFL players, and half of them said they'd try to, to conceal a concussion so they could play. And also, Rob, Seau's official stats, rather unbelievably, after 20 seasons, do not list a single concussion. That is amazing considering how many, uh, how many years he played and the number of tackles during that time. Tamon Bradley, thanks for that report. And as you can imagine, thousands of sports figures and fans both are mourning Seau on Twitter. John Elway tweeted, quote, Junior was a true competitor and a special player. Also, skateboarding legend Tony Hawk said this, you were an inspiration for turning success into greater good. Thank you for making San Diego a better place for youth. And of course, we will have much more on this story coming up later today on GMA.